Hi guys, I want to share with you one of my favorite spiritual ninja tools in which I send energy, remove energy, um, uh, send angels to others, and transform a situation. And you just use your hands actually your secret swords and these are your swords these two fingers so there's two methods into this the long method is if you use two hands and I'm just gonna use an example of removing energy from myself so for me um, if I'm feeling doubt or anxiety or fears um, or squirreliness which has been the situation lately um, so please remove this squirreliness from me now and then I flip my fingers I give it a little bit of a spin to wind up the energy, pull down, give it a little squeeze, and I let it go into the ethers. Now, if I want to install energy on myself, I will say something like, I am, and it doesn't matter what uh, position your hand is, okay? It depends on if you're left-handed or right-handed. Um, I'll say, I am courageous, confident, and clear. And this is how I ground myself. I breathe into that. I envision myself as such. Turn the energy, give it a little spin, anywhere from three to nine times. Pull down, give it a little squeeze, and let go. I learned this method about five years ago from Grandmaster David Harris, who is an awesome Qigong master. So um, it's been uh, a great help for me. Sometimes I remove headaches in that way. Uh, that was when I was having a lot of headaches with my ulcerative colitis. So I'll say, please remove the headache from me now. Give it a little spin. Please remove the cramps in my um, stomach now or in my body now. Okay. Now when I send angels, that's what I um, will uh, envision angels surrounding a certain person and I will ask for help for them. Please send angels to Jennifer now for the highest good. Help her see her answers and come to a place of compassion. And the reason is because we want to let go of our judgments. Sometimes the universe has lessons for us that we can't take away and we want them just to find peace and an answer that's suitable for them at this time. Okay, so then I imagine that. Switch the energy. Give it a, a little spin, pull down, let go. And you're sending that energy out to the ethers. So there is a short version of it as well. And this one's really fun. So you just need one hand. And so if you're in um, a situation where you're uncomfortable or things aren't going somewhere your, your way or someone's being mean, you can just use one hand and you use the peace sign. Okay, and so let's say, I don't like the way this situation is going. Please remove the obstacles in my path. Then you wrap it around, and then you turn the energy. You wind things up anywhere from three to nine times. Give it a little squeeze. Let it go. It's really fun, and um, if you use your spiritual tools, I don't know, it doesn't make sense sometimes, but it does shift the energy, moves the stagnation, and it seems magical. Sometimes if it doesn't happen within 20 minutes of doing this, um, it may be just the way that you ask, do it again, or use the word now, because um, the universe didn't know that you needed it now. I would love to know what you think and your results, and um, please share this video because it's absolutely free, and energy is not good or bad, it can be transformed. So um, I have other tips on my channel as well. Check those out, please share them. And if you want to make a personal appointment with me for Chinese face reading or energy clearings, you can do that online at soyouboutique.net.